hi guys what's up here welcome to my youtube channel if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe so guys today i'm going to be taking you guys on an empty house tour so yeah um i'll be an eyeball at home and i am so happy to give you guys a house tour today so this is a six bedroom house with five bathrooms built by first texas home it's located somewhere in dallas Fort Worth area and yeah it was it's a newly constructed home so it took 14 months to get it done yeah so uh, the contract was signed sometime last year october and now we got our keys two days ago so yeah let me show you guys around let's go so this is it guys Ooh. welcome home so when you walk in on the left hand side you have the former living and the former dining and then on the right hand side you have a double glass leading to a, a study or an office so this is just a view giving you guys the view all right so let's start here here you have the double glass door leading to the study slash home office so this is gonna be hobby's home office all right so the gray doors and the gray trims you see um it was like i don't know we didn't do it on purpose it just happened and then we loved it and we decided to keep it so in this study we have like a closet where he can store stuff but you see already um received some packages because this house is just two days old um it was built from scratch so it's a newly built home so there's a door leading out and this door leads out to the let me say he's in the office you want to use the restroom you don't have to go around the house you can just use this restroom here yeah. so that's the use of this door all right so let me take you back Okay, this is the glass door. Let me take you guys back out. Former living. Former living. And then I love these windows. Look, look at our neighbor's house. So I have so many ideas. Yeah, I'm going to put like a console table and I'll put a, um, a sofa, like sectional. And then yeah, we have the former dining. I'm going to put a big dining table rectangle with like eight um, chairs. So you see the staircase. Yeah. Now we are heading to the main living room. Uh, so guys, um, just so I want to give you guys heads up. The fireside is blank because we left it on purpose. So what the builder was offering us to put in the fireside was just tile. And we didn't want to put any tile. So we decided to leave it blank and do like a marble finish from the bottom to the top So this is the kitchen area so guys these windows these windows is to die for like i'm trying to show you guys but these windows see these windows right here them windows is to die for i love it so that's the patio at the back so we go into the kitchen. This is the kitchen. This is gonna be our breakfast nook. Yeah. So this is this is the breakfast nook. I'm gonna put like um a round marble table with four chairs. And yeah, so that's where the refrigerator will be. Um those are our cabinets. We have the California Island with marble. Ooh. Okay, so 
we have the dishwasher so again just like what we did for the fireside we did the same for the backsplash the backsplash is left empty on purpose guys we will do our backsplash ourselves and what i want to do is i want to do the backsplash to match with the countertop so i want this same um um this and this same marble look this same the same stone for the backsplash and our builder wasn't offering that they wanted us to put towel in the back but i didn't want it so i told them to leave it blank i'll get it done myself in a week or two so whoa, that's our neighbor so i love this neighborhood i can't even lie guys so those are the cabinets we have our appliances everything is here um we have the double oven with the microwave oh we have our butler's pantry so the the builder they left extra paints um for us to paint the wall or anywhere we feel like we needed to put extra paint on that's the butler's pantry also the same thing it's left blank for a reason we're going to put a, a backsplash ourselves in a week or two when that is done i'll show you guys so this is the pantry guys so as you can see right the floor in the kitchen area it's um it has this marble look marble finished it's tile um with like good quality with them marble marble obsession so this is the view from here from the kitchen area so yeah there we go guys that's where the tv will go all right so now i'm taking you guys to the patio the patio the patio so there here we got the patio patio guys patio so our patio is high ceiling and this is one of the most beautiful patios i've ever seen in my life like it's so beautiful so that door the that door that that is our master um bedroom door so i'll get to that area and then you'll see what i'm saying all right let me take you guys to the bedrooms the other side of the house this is almost almost six thousand square foot house i like this small section here i don't know what i'm gonna do here i'm still trying to figure out so much work to do all right so yeah we have our master bedroom Um, that's the backyard so that's the door i was telling you guys about this le leading to the patio and uh, this was an extra cost this was an upgrade to have this door installed there's a lot of things that we did that was upgrade in this house like so many things didn't come with this home like we did so many upgrades like i can't even begin to mention all right so this is his closet. See how big? Look at these guys. This is so big. Oh, this is the master. Master bathroom. Look at how spacious this is. Shower. bathtub like this was a no no like it was like either i have a standalone bathtub or i don't want the home this like was something i couldn't compromise on i love standalone bathtubs it just gives that um contemporary feeling so this home 
we tried as much as possible to make it like a contemporary home that's the bath like the restroom or the toilet or the whatever you guys call it so this is my closet guys I'm gonna do I'm gonna do the IKEA um walk I'm gonna turn it into the IKEA or walk-in closet or what they call it the custom made one. I'm gonna put like chandelier light there. It's a lot of things I'm gonna do in uh, I'm gonna change all the light fixtures. Not all, like most of the light fixtures I'm gonna change like let's say 80%. Yes, definitely. Alright guys, we're going outside. We're going out, going out. So out of the master um, bedroom, we have this entryway. Now we have the, uh, what do they call it? Linen closet. And then on the opposite side, we have a storage underneath the staircase. By the way, this house was built by First Texas Home. So that's the office. See? It can uh, go in from this way. All right, guys. So opposite to the door that is leading to the office from this angle, we have our bathroom, guest bathroom. So we decided, actually it was a bathroom without shower. We put the shower there, it was an upgrade. Alright, so this is the first um, bedroom downstairs. So downstairs there are two bedrooms. That's the closet. Each bedroom has a closet, like a small one. I think this is one of the smallest closet, if I'm not mistaken. The other ones are bigger. Alright, on your left hand side you have the laundry room or utility room. So this is the where the washer and dryer will be. And, and this is the garage. Garage, guys. I'm gonna open the garage door. So, this is the garage, guys. Ooh. See, look at the neighborhood. Ooh, I love it. So I know you. I know you can't see. I don't want to go a bit closer because I'm not wearing. On, I'm not putting on shoes. So the that switch you see, the white one, that's to um, charge electric cars. So now we are heading upstairs, guys. I love the staircase, guys. I love it. All right, we're going upstairs. Upstairs. So upstairs, we have a media room, um, a game room uh, with a wet bar. We have four bedrooms upstairs with three bathrooms. So game room, guys. With a bar need to see put a small fridge there so i'm gonna pull this sectional maybe three four seater and make sure it doesn't block this stair like the rays i mean i like the chandelier light but i'm definitely gonna change the chandeliers in this house i don't like them this is beautiful but it's not for me so this is the game room guys 
and this is the view i love this view i can't even lie look at that i can't wait when it's funny she's gonna be so beautiful gosh all right guys so let me take you guys to the left first That's why it's called Jack and G, because it has two rooms sharing a bathroom. And yeah, I mean, honestly, if we could do this all over, we would have made all of them have, a, have their own bathroom. But we didn't think of it at that moment. So this is the other room. So here yeah, on my right hand side, living the one of the Jack and Jill bedrooms, we have our media room slash cinema room. This is where all the fun stuff is gonna happen because we love watching movies. I love movies. Like I just I love movies, but I don't like going out to go to the cinema and sit down there so we can have our own make our own popcorn section here. Yeah? Have our own popcorn section. So, um, Home Pro is still needs to come. We scheduled an appointment mid February to come and put do get it done like a proper media room with a, pro, a projector and everything. It's gonna be so nice when it's done. I can't wait. This is the view standing from here. You can see the main door and this beautiful chandelier light. All right, on the left hand side, we have the fit bedroom where, with its closet. Fit bedroom with its closet. And then this bedroom has a bathroom which has like an opening leading to the game room and media room. So you see the door connects to the media room and the game room and also to this bedroom bed. You can see it has like lock. The person in this bedroom can lock the door. So you can open the door to this bedroom. So they have their privacy at the same time. And then we have this room here, which is the seat, seat room with its own closet. Last bathroom. Got it. So guys, that's it for the tour. I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like and share this video. Thank you so much. Bye. See you in my next video.